This is not financial advice. This is not legal advice for entertainment, educational purposes only, and everything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff so you get a video. I put them out, see what I'm thinking, see I'm analyzing that data. Listen to me. I did a video a couple of hours ago concerning Ken Griffin selling his properties in Miami for less than half what it's worth. And a lot of people would, I guess they, I don't know, they don't want to believe that Ken Griffin would do something like that. But what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put a link at the bottom of this video, and I'm just gonna, this is just a quick update of the prior video. One of the properties that he sold was on Star Island in Miami. And the, the thing that's crazy is he bought the property in 2020 for $20 million. And then it was recently appraised in August of 2020 for 40 million dollars and then a few days ago he sold it to you're not gonna believe who but a rod yes a rod jennifer lopez a rod yankees a rod he sold to him for 18.5 million dollars now why would you pay 20 million for a property two years ago and then it's appraised at 40 million dollars and then you sell it for 18.5 million. Does that make logical sense? Does that make financial sense? There is something else going on. And, and I believe either he's liquidating because he's afraid they pierce the corporate veil or his money is so dry, is drying up. It's so illiquid that he needs the liquidity and these other real estate investors are taking advantage of that anyway i'm going to leave the link in the bottom so you can read the article yourselves okay have a great day god bless and i appreciate y'all on this journey with me oh hit the like button subscribe on our youtube algorithm stuff hit the youtube hit the youtube